so the next program is to compare k-means and dm algorithm and uh, rate uh, which one performs better so for this we're going to use the built-in classes so we can use uh, scikit-learn to make the program we're going to use the iris data set um, from sklearn import data sets from sklearn dot model dot cluster import k means from sklearn Okay, so so far we've imported the data sets which are built in, in the scikit-learn package. We have imported k means which is in the clusters of in the clustering methods, uh, and we are also using the method train test split to split our data into training and testing uh, part. So we are also going to need metrics to evaluate the performance of the algorithms. So, so we're going to use the load iris to load our data set into this variable iris. Um, we just print iris, it's a dictionary of data and uh, target and target names so we are uh, right now concerned with the data and target and we need to split it into train and test before we could uh, use it so the way to do it is x train x test y train y test equals train test split of iris dot data iris dot target so if you do that uh, x test should have a few entries and uh, x train should have more number of entries um, and uh, y train should have the corresponding uh, classes so in the iris data set basically 1 0 and 2 represent iris setosa virginica and versicolor so these are the various classes that we are trying to classify so now that we have loaded the data set and uh, separated them into the training and testing uh, the first part of it is done now uh, we are concerned with the model building so to build the model i am just going to use this cell we are going to build the model by saying uh, model equals k means and uh, n clusters n clusters is 3 suppose so this returns a k means model which classifies into 3 clusters so we are going to fit it model dot fit x underscore train comma y underscore train so uh, the model has been uh, trained on the data set model dot score okay so we've uh, finished the building the model so now we are supposed to uh, measure the accuracy score of the model so metrics dot accuracy score of y test comma model dot pre predict of 
x this okay so what we are trying to do here is we are going to take uh, the metrics which we have imported from scikit-learn and this is the method accuracy score so what accuracy score will do is compare uh, the results in y test and then against the prediction made by the model so what we are saying is take x test predict use make predictions from the model and see how it performs against y test and see how accurate it is so this is the accuracy score of the model so now we are going to import uh, Gaussian naive base to do the classification. So, yeah, we're going to use the Gaussian mixture. Sorry, so from sklearn dot mixture import. Gaussian mixture, right? So now we're going to create uh, another model. I'll just name it model two equals Gaussian mixture, and uh, the number of components is going to be three again. Uh, and we're going to fit this with We're gonna fit it with X train. So so we are doing the same thing here for the new model. We are using Gaussian mixture instead of using k-means, and we are fitting it. Uh, let me see if score works. And uh, now we are going to find the accuracy score. So it's going to be the same line except we're going to do it for model 2. So yeah, that's it. So based on like how you perform it, uh, these are the scores of the models and you can comment on which one performs better. Uh, that's it.